Hi, I'm Joe with Rogue Fabrication. We're going to shoot an exciting new video series called Will It Bend, Will It Notch? Uh, you're used to our regular technical videos, which might bore you, about how to make cool stuff like S-Bends and bend certain materials and bend quality. Uh, this time we're going to do some more interesting, funny stuff. Uh, this is a Made in the USA T-Post. We're going to bend and notch this. We're going to try to bend and notch this axle shaft, and then of course some aluminum square tubing and carbon fiber. Look how pretty that is. We're going to try and bend it. It's going to crack. And we're going to notch it. It's going to be awesome. So watch all the videos, comment, and uh, go ahead and give us some suggestions down there on what you think we should try and notch and bend. First on the list of will it notch, will it bend is ABS pipe. That stands for acryl and natural butadiene styrene. That is as deep as the tech is going to go because this is all for fun. So this is an inch and a half hole saw and we're going to see if it'll notch first. And clearly it will. We'll be bending this soon. That's a piece of inch and a half plastic pipe bent in a tubing bender. Next up is a T-post. There you go. Pretty nice looking notch. We're going to stop right there. Definitely not a uh, straight bend, but it did bend. And next up is carbon fiber. Uh, this is inch and a quarter, I believe. Outside diameter, it might be one inch, uh, real thin. I'm not sure why you'd notch carbon fiber, but it actually notches beautifully. We're going to bend our uh, carbon fiber tube. <laughs> that bent pretty nice. <laughs> Here in the Pacific Northwest, where Rogue Fabrication is, we have a lot of dug fur. So this is a piece of dug fur. Will it notch? Oh yeah, it'll notch. About what you'd expect. We're going to notch and bend the hydraulic cylinder that could power the machine that bends them. We're going to use some cutting fluid like usual on metal.
So that's a solid chunk of steel there. Kind of heavy, but uh, you can see the quality on the notch is there. So if you're going to, for some reason, combine these metals, boy howdy, there it is. nice bend. Of course solid bar. Okay this is a uh, hardened axle shaft uh, CV from a Honda so we put took the other end off and we're gonna cut right through it here inch and five eighths hole saw to what's 110 on our notcher which is 20 degrees back from a 90. It's a little bit off the center line there on the angle. There is no reason to uh, notch one of these anyway. <laughs> so, a lot easier to bend than it is to notch. This is 2 inch 375 wall, so 3 8 wall, uh, 1026 DOM, so it's that higher carbon, uh, it's used for hydraulics manufacturing, but it's about a 90,000 PSI yield, real tough stuff. And we're going to use cutting oil on this one, I like to use Tap Magic, it's the one we sell, it works pretty well. This one might take some time. Okay, this is that time when the whole saw reaches its maximum cut depth. So you get to break the little piece out with a grinder. There we go. That little piece stops the whole saw from making forward progress. Sorry guys watching the big screen. You're gonna get to watch this film a GoPro because we're not shooting this twice, it takes too long. That would be a functional notch.
We're gonna notch inch and a quarter 6061 T6 aluminum. Uh, this has an eighth inch wall, and we're gonna notch it through the points like this, but I think I'm gonna rotate this uh, cutting head a little bit here. We're gonna put it uh, at a different angle, 70 degrees. All right. Okay, another one that passed. And we're bending it on an old prototype die, so it's not really the six inch radius we recommend, so we don't really know what's gonna happen. Bad. Didn't crack. Wrinkles. Our uh, six inch radius die doesn't put the wrinkles in it, but that's a pretty tight band for aluminum square. Real brittle material. Well, that's about all the videos that we had planned for the first episode of Will It Notch, Will It Bend. Um, we hope this has been entertaining. Uh, be sure to like our videos, follow us on uh, YouTube and Facebook, and then when you comment, let us know what you'd like us to try bending. And um, it can be serious or funny, just make a suggestion, and uh, who knows, we might end up doing it for you.